The undulating countryside around Liège is green and delightful, and the local artisans have a long tradition of making really tasty food. I find Belgian charcuterie to my liking and very delicate. The smoked ham from Ardennes is a real treat with rye bread. The pâté ardennais, a coarse pork terrin, is a popular entree at the weekend, while the boulette liégeoise, a pork and veal meatball, is a French-Belgian family favorite. But perhaps the most special of the small goods is the boudin blanc, a white sausage flavored with herbs and sometimes walnuts. Yum. The country boasts almost 100 different varieties of excellent cheeses, many made with cow, ewes, or goat milk. Some are hard, some are soft ripened, and others have a wash rind. But none is more famous than the fromage de Herve. Madeleine Ancenne from La Ferme du Vieux Moulin has made this full flavored 200 gram cheese by hand all her life in the traditional way. C'est un fromage au lait cru qui est reconnu par la qualité de la terre qui va faire, on a une terre grasse et riche, qui va faire une herbe riche et qui va faire un lait de qualité. Et grâce à ça, on peut obtenir ce fromage-ci. Madeleine washes each cheese every few days by hand to remove any molds. After about one month, the cheese is ready to eat. I love tradition, but I also love tasting the cheese. A cheese with intense flavor, but very delicate. I like it. This leek tart, called Flemish au poireau, is the most popular family dish of the region. I first brown some diced bacon in a non-stick pan and transfer it to a plate to cool. Then I slowly cook three finely cut leeks in butter until soft and also transfer it to a dish to cool. With this leek tart, it's best not to use too much of the green of the leek. The white is more tender, it's sweeter and more delicious. I carefully line a lift-out flantin with savory pastry and prick the pastry about 25 times with a fork. I spread the bacon on the cold pastry, then evenly spread the leeks. In a bowl, I mix two eggs with a little salt and pepper, 80 ml of cream, and 40 ml of milk until runny. And carefully pour it on the leeks and trim the pastry neatly. I like to bake the tart in a hot oven at 220 degrees Celsius for about 35 minutes, as the pastry must be evenly cooked and the leeks set. Once turned out, I cut it carefully into wedges. The Flemish au poireau, my all-time favorite vegetable tart. This is the famous fishing port of Boulogne-sur-Mer in the north of France. And tomorrow, we have a look at the local catch and we visit one of the best cheese shops in France.